Hey guys, welcome back. I had a tool I happened to notice on my shelf and thought, well, I don't know how many people have used this one before. This is the DeWalt 12 volt inspection camera. It, you can order multiple leads for it, but this I believe is the three millimeter needle camera there on the end. Flexible, but it will hold its flex. So if you needed to go in a wall and to the right, you can actually just bend it and it will pretty it will stay with a bend in it however you want it's not like a noodle really it won't quite hold itself straight out it will pull down off the tool but as a rule when you're in a wall or something you can take a look the main thing i use it for is like if i'm fishing a wire for a receptacle or a thermostat or something like that i can stick it in there and find out if i'm actually hitting blocking in the wall that's there or something before I even waste my time trying to get through it all. It's good for a real quick peek. Uh, got It has a SD card slot and on top here you have your buttons where you can snap a picture. You can record if you want to, if you wanted to record what you're seeing in there and save it onto your SD card. And then you can take that SD card and email pictures to an owner or something if you needed to show them something that was in the wall something that was in a drain line whatever it is a waterproof camera so you can go right on down in a pipe I have used it in water before and pretty much the whole cable it works fine uh, as long as you don't have completely black water you're trying to go through you're okay but just looking through normal drains if you need to look down a sink whatever see if it's hair or if there's bolts in there or whatever you can look Normally, you know, you pull a P-trap, you take it out, you clean the P-traps no matter what, and then it's still plugged up, so you go ahead and stick this in the wall and see if it's right there. But it's got a adjustable light here on the end, and you can turn that brightness up and down, and that is your only focus, is how bright you turn that light. And it actually works okay. Here's your screen. Hold down the power button until it lights up DeWalt there. There you go. And now we're live. Like you can just see just right here on the bench, if you want to look at this, if you want to look at the glue bottles or whatever. Now, camera upside down, obviously, right there. So you have to find out where right side up would be. Has a 2x magnification right now. So we go down through one of the dog holes in the bench. You can see, you can actually read what's down there. With this camera and that's under the bench right there and you can turn that light see if you turn that light up too high that glare will get so bad you can't see turn too low you can't read and uh, anyway let's try another hole there we go let's see what we can read down in here oh it looks like a looks like a saw blade ah uh, yeah looks like a Diablo right there looks like a Diablo saw blade but anyway there's the light up and down you can adjust it just like you want it and you can see here it's telling you that telling me I don't have an SD card in it does have date and time stamps and the battery deal I just pulled this off the shelf so my battery in this needs to charge up from this but it the screen may go dead but I'll go ahead and show you this anyway you can pull the screen off so you could actually set the screen somewhere if you wanted to look at it and then look around under your wherever you needed to look with with this portion of it and this portion controls all the camera and it bluetooths back and forth with the screen so the two don't have to be connected in order to operate you can go ahead and just use this any way you'd need to to look and just leave your screen right up here in front of you on a shelf or maybe stick you a magnet on the back of it where you can just hang it up there and take a peek. Anyway, it's a handy little tool. I bet I only have to use it a couple times a month, but that moment when you have to use it, you really need it bad. So, it's not a cheap tool, but it's pretty handy. I think you can get little cheap ones to hook on your smartphone now for not a whole lot. But this is kind of cool, and if you need to, if you just feel the need to own a DeWalt inspection camera, this is the 
This is the one I got. And it's it's just fine. I'd get it again. I'd get it again for this. It's also this this really makes you look good to a customer, I have to say. The times I've pulled this out, I have gotten really good reception to using it. The customers are really impressed that you can you've got the equipment on you as a contractor to go ahead and take a look where there's no other way to do so. But anyway, that's the 12 volt max. Uh, I believe the one I got here, it comes with this standard cable. There's two or three other cables and you can get extensions and everything. But I honestly, what it came with is just fine. They have a thicker one and I think they have a really thin one also that have different resolutions and all. But overall use, good little deal. Um, I don't know that I'd spend whatever it was. I want to say it was $250 or something. I'd probably go with one for my camera phone, to be perfectly honest, because 30 bucks on Amazon, maybe 100 on the outside, if you're really going for something good, it's probably all you're going to have to spend. As long as you know you have a modern phone, you're willing to connect it up and actually use your phone for that. But I think I would now. But this is, I already have this, so I haven't messed with ones for my camera phone. But anyway, thanks for watching, and we'll try to get another one up on another tool here shortly. But DeWalt 12 volt inspection camera. Pretty handy little tool when you need it. It lives right up here with my, on my charging rack. I've got a rack of uh, DeWalt chargers built right into the trailer in this cubby, and two receptacles built in. So I have ability to charge about. 12 batteries at a time up here and then my DeWalt power station is back here that light won't blind us DeWalt power stations right here and it'll charge four at a time so I just keep it up there with that anyway thanks for watching don't forget to like subscribe make comment do you use one for your camera phone do you use another brand what what do you use to do your inspection when you need to if you have to know what's behind that wall before you run a screw in it push a wire through it whatever see ya